Hello everybody, it's Mankalore here with another CPU race in Mario Kart DS. This time we'll be doing a clan war. Yeah, we'll be playing the team races. And the player we'll be watching is Rob on the Rob Legs. Dem Legs. But yeah, also on co-commentary we have Ellie Tendo. Hey! <laughs> Please don't make any more bad jokes. Oh, uh, that's uh, no promises. <laughs> Uh, let's go ahead and get, uh, I mean, the normal competitive standard is like 12 races, but this is, that probably would take a while for this video to finish, so, yeah. They're computer players, it would take like twice the time. Yeah. <laughs> See, I'm only doing four races for this. Uh, yeah, and those are the teams. We'll be Rob, uh, Toad, Yoshi, and Bowser versus DK, Luigi, Waluigi, and Dry Bones. It's a shame that, like, Donkey Kong and Bowser went the other way around. Or no, actually, the Ouija would be the other way around. Then it'd be, like, the good guys versus the bad guys. Oh, yeah. But yeah, let's see. What tracks shall we pick? Uh, I'm gonna pick different tracks than what we did in the, uh, free-for-all video. Uh... Actually, could I pick the tracks just to see what the hell happens? <laughs> Alrighty, you pick the track. Alrighty, so the race that Ellie has picked will be on N64 Choco Mountain. Let's, uh, go Cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. I mean, I'm eating chocolate right now, so I just couldn't help it. It's like, I want to see a chocolate track. <laughs> <laughs> and they're off. Rob does not get the boost start. He's also... <laughs> we got the uh, blues out in the uh, top spot, and with the reds in 2 or 3 right now. But the reds are in the bottom spots. Oh yeah, I one thing I should mention... Trash CPU by the seams of it. <laughs> yeah. The one thing I should mention about the team race is all items will affect all players, so if you use a lightning bolt, it'll strike your allies as well. That's dumb. Yep. <laughs> but actually, they could have done that in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, that would have been very good. Yep. So technically, Mario Kart DS is actually the best game to have, like, team races on using the actual team mode. Oh, there goes a bolt, though. Only, only thing is, though, no one plays this game anymore because the Wi Fi is almost dead unless you have mods on it. Yep. Oh, well, we're we just trying to go in for that shell snipe, but he misses. So we got DK on oh, first how place. How pixelated this game is! <laughs> what was that? I forgot how pixelated this game is. Look at those player icons like on the side of all those portraits. It's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Nintendo DS days. There's an early shock, and yes, lightning bolt goes off and strikes everyone, including uh, Luigi's teammates. I always knew Luigi was evil. Yep. Yoshi's got a red shell, he's gonna throw it to the, uh, possibly first place. If he can knock first place out, he can get that, uh, top spot. I should, I should note that the point distribution is, uh, different than in free-for-alls. Oh, wow, those CPUs oh. again destroyed. Man, yeah, look at that. Rob just went from, like, sixth to third place because of all that. Rob's got a red shell. He's just gotta time it so that he doesn't throw it at his teammate. But Waluigi has a red shell behind him, so he better hold on to it. And Luigi has sent out the blue shell despite his teammate being in first place. That is some very bad team play right there. I noticed that Rob threw it backwards, hit Waluigi, but Waluigi also hit Rob. They traded. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice trades we got there. Oh man, what's going on in the top two? They're just killing each other. Everybody's close to each other. It's an animal match. It's a dinosaur versus a monkey. Oh no, the monkey. Oh, the monkey's breaking away. Well, even though- even if DK wins the race, uh, the Reds are in the top- next three spots, so that's actually gonna be probably a winning race for the Red team. Oh, he's bumping his teammate- oh, he bumped him into a banana peel. But they it's can't see- It's because the, the uh, blueprint were in combat, he just couldn't see a thing. Yep. But while we just starting to make a comeback, he's up to third place. Oh, and Rob well, just bumped his teammate off the edge. <laughs> Cause he's a bad- That poor toad! Yep. Rob well, gets a last minute blooper, and looks like DK will end up taking this top spot. Oh, no! Uh, we got, uh, yeah, blue with a top spot, red in 2-3, and yeah. It's a pretty close one, look at that, three point difference between both teams. Rob, how did you not know that poor Toad? <laughs> yeah, he got last place because of that, that team kill. <laughs> yeah, there's not very good team chemistry going on with between both teams. They, there's a lot of team killing going on, this is just, <laughs> this is pathetic. One like equals one prayer for Toad. Yep. <laughs> Okay, and for race number two, it'll be Waluigi Pinball. Let's get this started. Notice how intentionally picking the tracks with the most had. Oh, yeah. Because they're CPUs. <laughs> yeah, let's see how they deal with this, because there's going to be a lot of pinballs at the very start of the race. And unlike in the Mario Kart 7 online ver version, there's actually two pinballs at the, uh, was it the, was it the bumper section at the very end of the track. 
There's a pinball. Can they get around the pinball? And Rob decides to run straight into the pinball. A nice going. I've also find it a funny scenario seeing how well Waluigi does on Waluigi pinball. <laughs> yeah. I think we've got some uh, commentator uh, bias going on here if you picked uh, Waluigi pinball. I think she's got a favoritism toward Waluigi. And there's two boos in Prey. <laughs> Waluigi can smash! I mean, what? <laughs> Ooh, Rob stole a red shell with that boo. I forgot that multiple boos could be in play. And I don't know why that red shell decided to just go flying straight into the wall, but okay. Because the mapping on this game and games like Double Dash were terrible with items, that's why. <laughs> yep. Alright, so we got Yoshi out in first place with DK in second, Toad in third, so... But right now, we got two reds in the back spot, so... Well, if this does not change anytime soon, this could be a losing race for the red team. It definitely seemed like that uh, Toad is a stronger CPU because of your uh, fatness as a robot, and it just killed him. Yeah. <laughs> I see that. Rob's got the star, he's able to get through here, and there don't seem to be any pinballs in the way. Lucky for him. Rob missing the items, he could have easily gotten a bullet bill from that. And so did Bowser, they could have gotten the, uh, the shock. It seems like Rob's drifted decently, though, catching up quite quick, so... Yeah, seems like they're doing some CPU rubber banding here. Oh, and he gets hit by a pinball! There's no more rubber banding from that now. He gets a bullet bill, that's gonna really help him out. Oh, now the double bullet- The bullet bill is actually not should give away! Yeah. <laughs> Rob's up to 6th place now, thanks. Invincible. Yep. Now it's the final lap, and the race is actually starting to get a bit closer. Rob can just get- actually start hitting the item boxes, and that way he can actually start making a comeback. You got a golden mushroom. Can you make these turns? Oh, he's making these turns pretty well with the golden mushroom. All right, I mean, Bob is a robot after all. Yep. <laughs> okay, looks like the reds have most of the top spots. What was that drift? What was that drift? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell was that? I don't know what I just saw, but yeah, that was just really bad driving. Oh, there's a last minute shot going off, and it strikes everyone. And <laughs> Rob gets the awesome shell snipe on Luigi. I don't know whether to be impressed or disappointed by how this CPU is performing right now. Yep. Oh man, all these pinballs. Oh man, that was terrible. If Rob had just not driven so poorly earlier, he probably would have gotten in a top spot. But the red team gets to that winning first place, and let's see if that was a good race for them. They are now in the lead by two points somehow. I don't know, because of all that... beats me. <laughs> Yoshi. It's Yoshi and Donkey Kong. They're the ones who are fighting it out. The rest is just you. You guys, the rest of them are just terrible. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty close one. That's, we got two more races left. Are uh, you sure this isn't on the Wii, U, the Wii version? It looks very similar, if you get what I mean. I <laughs> <laughs> see what you mean there. But yeah, the next track is going to be totally not uh, Moo Moo Meadows or track that was eventually ripped off in Mario Kart Wii. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, what is it with Nintendo's obsession with cows? I don't know, maybe they just, uh, want to keep moving forward. Will you seriously stop milking these jokes? No, I won't. <laughs> also, yeah. your lactose is intolerant, you shouldn't like any of this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, uh, even though if it'll kill me, I'll just drink it anyway, yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh man, that bump from his teammate, man. Dang it, Bowser was with you. Gotta be careful with those golden mushroom boosts, you just knock your teammate Rob into last, last place. Rob's pulling out the star. I think Joy Bones is trying to draft off Rob, but he doesn't seem to be getting any closer. If Rob could just slam on those brakes, he can actually hit him with a star. Oh, that would've been awesome if he actually did that. Oh, and there goes the shot. Why well, remember Joy Bones isn't very quick, but acceleration is broken in this game. Yeah. But he has a really good, he has the, one of the best, well, probably one of the best vehicles in the game, uh, the Drive Bomber. But it's a CPU though, so it doesn't know how to use it properly. Yeah. And Rob is still missing the items. And this is a pretty short track, so he's gotta actually hit those item boxes to give his team a, a chance, because, yeah, the, the reds are in the bottom three. Oh, now he's starting to run <laughs> He's <the> missing <laughs> Final lap. Reds in top two. Oh, Waluigi and Yoshi are fighting out. The DK getting a distant lead. But the reds don't. Going faster, robot. Yep. Oh, and he's man. missing everything. Yeah, this. Yeah, this. <laughs> their team backer is not doing very well, and he got last place. That was a very bad race for the red team. Yeah. Oh man, look at that point difference now. It went from two to like uh, looks like seventeen. Yeah, seventeen points. 
Like I keep saying, it's the Yoshi and the Donkey Kong that are carrying both teams. Yep. <laughs> Maybe Waluigi, but that's stretching it. Yeah, definitely it's, yeah. DK and Yoshi are the top players in this uh, match. But if the Reds can uh, pull off an Amer a miracle in the next race, maybe they get like top three or uh, top four. Maybe they could possibly win this. Well, let's just see what happens. Alrighty, the the Red team is going to need some cheap, cheap tactics to win this final race, which is going to be on Cheap Cheap Beach. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Alright, there they are. And half the players are off, and half the other players did not get the boost start. They might be trying to bag for this. Seems like Rob's trying to sandbag once again, but he, he, if he actually, you know, pro tip, if you want to sandbag, you actually gotta hit the item boxes. <laughs> the item boxes weren't actually there, you gotta remember, this is the DS one, not Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Yeah. <laughs> See? No items there. You gotta oh. remember, they place it differently. It's different. And Rob is still missing the items. Rob is not doing very well for his team. If, yeah, if the red team loses, you guys know who to blame. He's doing the no item challenge, obviously. Yeah, it's no items in a team format. <laughs> okay, now I finally hit an item box. And pulls the shock. And spam. And kills everyone. <laughs> yeah. Should've just waited for his teammates to get, like, stars or booze or bullets, and yeah, he probably could've helped them out. Can he get an item? Uh, oh, he doesn't no item there. There's the items. <laughs> it's Mariko, not Mariko, it's a lot. Yeah. Oh, there's a blue shell going from Luigi up to Yoshi. Yoshi, get the tax evasions and all that stuff. Yeah, he paid the blue shell like the taxes, but unfortunately he did not. But he's still in first place right now. He, Yoshi is a light character, so he does have those, uh, what is it, uh, that high acceleration stuff. He can recover very quickly. Rob's still missing the item boxes. Yeah, he's a very bad teammate for this for the red team. I'd say the the red, the red team's probably going to lose at this point since they don't seem to be uh, doing very well with picking up the item boxes and just yeah overall bad driving. Okay, now Rob, I, don't like, I think that's like the second or third item he's got. He's got a blue he shell. He used it on your shit. <laughs> and yes, nice team play from Rob, throwing a blue shell at his own teammate in first place when the, his team is down by 17 points. And then he proceeds to hit a crab. Rob is gone. Do, 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 Don't make me play the song out on my computer. Oh, no. <laughs> and looks like Yoshi's about to, uh, yeah, finish first place. But unfortunately, that won't really matter since the Blues were in the next three spots. And yeah, the, uh, Blue team wins 109 to 87. Yikes. 22 point so difference. If, if you really analyze it though, if you look at Donkey Kong and Yoshi, they tied as CPU, so they were the dominant CPUs. It re really, what mattered was the other three on each team, basically. Yep. It's how they align. It's how they align the computer players. They have. To, they always have. It happens in every Mario Kart game. There's always two that are stupidly strong, and ever all the other CPUs are brain dead. Basically, <laughs> this yep. is what happened. You got a brain dead. Yep, most of, yeah, most of the brain dead ones were on the red team. That's unfortunate. Yoshi couldn't carry his team hard enough. Unfortunate, but yes, that's GG's to both the teams. You did, you both did very badly. Alrighty, that was pretty crazy. So, do you have anything else to say before we go, Ellie? Um, your CPUs are terrible. No matter which one you pick, you you should just give up with it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, that's yeah. Ellie's uh, life advice: just give up. Yeah, so like good <laughs> That's not advice. life advice I'm trying to give, I'm saying <laughs> about the computer players. Yeah, hashtag... What's wrong with you? Yeah, it's the complete context, context of the whole con uh, conversation. So yeah, that's what Ellie said. Yeah, just give up, people. Give up. Alrighty, so that's gonna do it for this video. If you guys want more CPU races, maybe like a full-on, like, CPU MKU tournament series, like on, like, MK Central, then we can do that. So, thank you all so much for watching, and see you all next time. Bye bye You're an idiot. Oh. Takes one to know one.